Welcome back to our channel, where we dare to explore the darkest corners of reality and uncover the spine-chilling tales that lurk within. The Velisca Axe murders of 1912 were a horrific and perplexing crime that remains unsolved to this day. On the night of June 9th, Josiah and Sarah Moore, their four children, Herman, Catherine, Boyd, and Paul, and two visiting Stillinger sisters, Lena and Ina, were bludgeoned to death with an axe as they slept in their home in Villisca, Iowa. The brutal killings left the small town shaken and launched a massive investigation that spanned years. The crime scene was particularly chilling, with the victims found in their beds, bludgeoned beyond recognition. Bizarre details, like a piece of bacon left by the killer and mirrors covered with clothing, added to the mystery. Despite efforts to track the killer with bloodhounds, no concrete leads emerged initially. Over the years, various suspects were considered, including a traveling minister named Reverend Lynn G.J. Kelly. Kelly signed a confession claiming God told him to kill, but later recanted and was acquitted by two separate juries. No other suspects were ever tried for the murders. Some theories link the Villisca murders to a potential serial killer operating by train, responsible for similar axe murders across the country. However, no definitive connections have been made. The house where the murders occurred has been restored and is now a tourist attraction, with many visitors reporting paranormal experiences. Despite extensive investigations and renewed interest over the decades, the Villisca Axe murders remain one of Iowa's most infamous and perplexing unsolved crimes. The identities of the killer or killers and their motive continue to elude researchers and investigators over a century later.